Alright, hey guys, you're doing Keon, so this is going to be part two. This is going to be the setting up process video for the Microsoft Service Pro, which you have seen on my last video. I unboxed it. Now we're gonna experience on how to set it up, give it life, and let's see how well it performs. Let's see how it sounds like, etc. So uh, he'll go along with me for this ride. And again, if you guys are interested in buying this, I'll leave the link on the description below. All right, let's set this thing up. All right, this is the Microsoft Surface Pro 9 tablet. We got the camera right here and the, the Windows logo, the up and down buttons right here, and the power button. So uh, first thing we need to do is to set it up open the hinge right here and uh, let's see let's start in the side right here so it's gonna be easier and uh, yeah this is how you set it up and now open it like this and now I brought this with a keyboard so it's just easy as one two three here we go so uh, this is the Surface Pro tablet first we're gonna charge this so here's the AC adapter we're gonna attach this to the side right here so it lights up when it's attached and now uh, it's time to set it up so we're gonna open this up with the power button and now the uh, windows logo is booting up so we're just gonna wait for uh, maybe several minutes okay it says uh, just a moment and uh the setting up process might take a while, so uh, I'm just gonna do a lot of skips in this. Alright, a white Windows logo uh, appeared earlier and now we're here, so... To set up your device using a screen reader, turn on narrator by pressing Windows plus Oh, I love the mouse. It's very easy. It's kind of like a real mouse. Press Windows plus U or select the accessibility icon in the bottom corner. So we're gonna do the, the English US and... Uh, country region of course we're living in the philippines so we're gonna pick that philippines of course i grew up with the u.s uh, keyboard so let's pick that i'm gonna add a second keyboard layout nope skip so we're gonna connect to the internet i'm using starlink by the way all right, as you can see, I'm now connected to the internet, so we're just gonna continue on with the setup. I was checking for updates. It might take a while, so let's see. So as you can see on this keyboard, it's very nice. Kinda looks like your ordinary uh, laptop keyboard, which uh, has a very decent size uh, trackpad and uh, yeah it's a perfect size for those who are just uh, working on the go so we'll just have to wait and we're just gonna keep the PC on sit back and relax while the magic happens okay all right so it says it's gonna restart so Updates are underway. Please keep your uh, computer on. It's very important that uh, you keep your uh, device on while it's updating. So, all right. So after an hour of waiting, it's now booted up, and uh, hopefully it is now updated. So we're gonna type in our name. All right, let's type it key on. Here we go. And just a moment, it's now loading again. Hopefully, it doesn't take too much of my time so we're gonna pause this and uh, wait for any updates and uh, we're now back to the uh, the Windows logo screen now with the scrolling earlier I had to wait like an hour and nothing was happening so I had to uh, to restart and now we're back again but this time we have the uh, the loading screen and uh, finally having some uh, progress so we're just gonna wait for a little bit and now it is loaded hopefully there is some progress all right it's asking for me to uh, to sign in on my uh, Microsoft account so we're gonna sign in since I have an account over there so I'm just gonna fill up my personal information for a bit all right we're gonna sign in 
and it's probably gonna be loading some of the apps I've already downloaded for Microsoft so here are my files it's gonna be transferring over here on this tablet so we're gonna click next yes All right, that was fast. All right, we're gonna set up a pin, which I always do. All right, we're gonna click OK. So we're gonna click yes to all by clicking next, next. And next all right I do want entertainment also on gaming maybe do some creativity and maybe add in some family and business yeah let's just uh, click all yeah accept so it's been loading use your phone from our PC so uh, I think I'm just gonna skip on that for a bit okay we're gonna skip on using Microsoft uh, apps we use this uh, Microsoft apps nowadays I always use a uh, Google Google Docs and uh, Google spreadsheets and they're free so we're gonna skip on the PC game pass I don't know if you can do gaming on this because uh, it's gonna be too much for a tablet to be a gaming accessory so getting things ready for you this might take a few minutes I should have uh, done this like an hour ago where I just reset my uh, tablet because uh, yeah, it's, it, w it was stuck from a uh, Windows logo for for more than an hour so I'm getting impatient for waiting so I hope this like uh, takes like few minutes so we'll just see so it just told me to just uh, keep my PC uh, plug in so we're almost there pretty nice uh, progress and now we're on our home screen finally after like uh, an hour or more we're already on our home screen and uh, yeah, let's do some uh, testing on the sounds for a bit here. Let's see. Turn off the, the mic. So currently, it's uh, how will I know the battery life on this one? 86%. So it's a slow charge. And so, yeah, we're going to test the sound on this uh, tablet right here full sound let's see so this is the 70% this 80% brightness Let's try to put it on 70 because uh, the brightness is too much. And the volume, that, that was 50% earlier, so this is the 100%. So this is 1080, 1080p. Looking really good. And you know, being a tablet. The last creeper. This one, I'm not quite sure you're gonna survive. Oh, we don't believe Steve's gonna. Yeah, being a tablet, you can uh, just uh, remove this to your keyboard. And uh, yeah, like this one, it's pretty nice. Or you can do the uh, horizontal and uh, back to portrait. Here we go very easy so I'm gonna catch again 
It's pretty nice. So let's do a sound test. Here we go. Here's a hundred percent. Yeah, subscribe. I haven't tried the, the 4K feature. If it's gonna look good on 4K. So let's just watch a random video. I've noticed that I'm clicking on the, the right side and it opens up the uh, the menu. So that's a good feature to know that there's a left click and a right click, even though it's only one click. Yeah, there's two separate clicks. If you do the, the left click, it's about to, uh, to select something. And the right click is for uh, putting out the, the menu, which supposed to be, yeah, now it's popping up. So let's watch, try to watch a, uh, a 4K video of mine. Very nice. Let's see if it works well. I have to, uh, to play it in full volume. It's already uh, 6 on 5, so uh, we need to hurry up and eat some food. If you like, we'll spend 15 minutes of eating. And then uh, I'll go grab a taxi, go to the airport. Alright, it works well. So, I'm gonna tell you the reason why I needed a, uh, a small tablet. Windows tablet specifically, so I'm gonna share with you why I decided to buy this. Alright, so the reason I decided to buy this tablet, aside of course it's uh, very portable, is uh, I can use one of the uh, apps that I usually use on my PC, which is the, the Upwork app. So I do have uh, a job or projects that are in Upwork, so you can open this. And uh, as you can see, I can now open the Upwork app. And Upwork usually doesn't download on uh, certain uh, tablets like Samsung. So right now, because this is a Microsoft product, they can uh, you can definitely download the Upwork app and uh, you know do some work on it, do some hourly contracts, uh, you know, do some manual timing. So this is the main reason I decided to buy this tablet. From Microsoft and the second reason that I bought this tablet is it's very very portable I will use my uh, my bag over here and uh, as you can see it's very small this bag is very small but I can definitely uh, fit this tablet inside my bag right here so I'll show you guys so as you can see, this really uh, fits perfectly inside my bag. So I can just close it like this. And now uh, I can definitely uh, bring this anywhere without using a computer bag. I just use my uh, ordinary, uh, you know, uh, carry-on bag to which uh, it is uh, very convenient for me. So. Uh, yeah, one of the few reasons why I bought a tablet so I can work anywhere and I can bring it anywhere so also I want to show you the uh, the camera on this uh, device so it has its own camera so here what it looks like I believe this is a 1080p uh, quality camera you can definitely uh, I guess flip the camera let's see Yeah, so I can definitely uh, flip the camera right here, do some zoom calls, something like that. So uh, definitely it's going to be very good. So, hey, that's me. And uh, yeah, it's very good. Let's try to uh, test the audio in this. All right, test one, two, three. Test one, two, three. All right, let's see how good the sound is gonna be. All right, test one, two, three. Test one, two, three. All right. Yeah, it sounds good. And I'm very satisfied with this product. Yeah, that is it for my setting up process and a little bit of a review. This is just a setting up video and to see how this uh, device works. So uh, I think that is it for this video. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And uh, please, if you haven't already, leave a like. Share this video, comment down below what other products you want to unbox and uh, review next. And as always, guys, subscribe to my channel, Keon PH Gaming. So uh, that is it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video, and I'll see you guys very soon.
Bye.